Good morning, my friends. <laughs> Happy switch up Saturday. <laughs> Just like, okay. I'm, I'm trying to, I, I'm staring at my stickers of emotions here. <laughs> I'm trying to pick out, figure out where I, where I fall on the spectrum. I guess I'm here. Yeah, about, I'm about here on, on the spectrum. So, um, yeah. Okay. Nail check. They're pretty effed up. <laughs> Let's just be clear. But one coat of this, one coat of this, no top coat. That's actually not too bad, considering. And, you know, a, a week. Yeah, a week of wear. So it's not that bad, considering. So this has been a week. Um not necessarily work has not been that bad i mean busy as always and all the things that keep you you know insane but they pay the bills so i want to talk about the elephant in the room the the literal elephant in the room which is this and if you saw my video this week you know that this is from the anniversary sale and it was underwhelming to say the least still has it wrapped up um here's the actual front of it i'm so angry <laughs> about this bag i really wanted to love it um but i'm so still pissed it's still sticky um i'm thinking that the sheets of whatever they use to applique the oh my god it smells so bad whatever they app used it, it's they didn't line it up correctly and you know whatever it 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 just hasn't done done well but it, i mean literally it it's trash um but the smell it it's not as strong as it was when i initially opened it which was really overwhelming but it still is in the room and this is my office where i work so i'm in here uh, 11 hours a day on 11 hours a day plus however much more i spend in here working because i'm workaholic but so at least 11 hours every day in here and unfortunately this thing was in here with me up on a shelf airing out and i thought nothing of it at first you know i was just like you know it's just up there no big deal and then i got you know a really bad headache one day and I'm like it's just the stress of work you know work's doing this to me I it, I'll unplug at the end of the day and I'll be fine no I'm like I was in a lot of pain I had to take some pills and I was just like well that was just odd but once I left out of here out of the office for a few hours it started to feel a little bit better and then um came in the next day was fine at first and then by Middle of the day, three o'clock or so, same thing. I'm like, I've got a headache again. What the hell? It's the damn bag. The smell of it. It just, it's, it's disgusting. So it's going back to Nordstrom's today. I'm going to take it down to the rack and return it there. I've got the box and everything over um, on my shelf. So that we packed up and returned. I, I'm just dis disappointed as Nordstrom does not usually have crap. This is utter crap. Like, Target would have had better. And that's amazing to me because Target's like, eh, it's okay. But um, yeah, I mean, I'm beyond, I think it's just pathetic. And I just had to laugh that this is, this is the original. That's what it will be after Sunday, after the anniversary sale. Uh, so after tomorrow. Yeah. After the um, sale ends, that's the price they want for it. I paid 60 I believe, for it. And it's not worth 10 in my opinion. I mean, rather with this, it's worth 10 I mean, the materials and everything like that. But I'm just saying. Anywho, I'm on a, a long diatribe about that. So that, <laughs> that, oh God, it smells so much. I, got, I do got to move it out of the way. So I'm going to hurry up here. So that prompted me to want to pick one of my fragrances or fragrances one of my um color changing nail polishes and i picked rage bait because <laughs> it raged me so much so this one's the one that turns from um this pink corally pink i guess would be the the tone so similar 
that's its cold state, but it goes to like a mango orange when it's hot. So the majority of my nail will be mango orange when it's I'm in the warm stage. So um, we're going to rage bait. That's already picked out. So I'm not going to bore you with that one over on the shelf. Um, fragrances did pretty well this week again with wore everything. I can't say I trust what... Um, happened during the week because where I might have thought that was the fragrance that gave me a headache it's probably this bag so I almost want to keep the 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 tray out but I enjoyed the fragrances so I'll, I'll talk about that when I get over there but that I'll, I'll give I wanted to give some context as to why um, I may or may not have been you know about everything so we'll pick out new fragrances. I don't know if I want to change bags. I, I like my Ricky this week, but I need to, you know, rotate and keep going. So I'm going to take a little time to figure out if I'm changing bags, take, take a moment or two, but um, I want to run down to the rack and return this out of my face so that I can have sand and come back and do all the things so I will check in start that process over there when I return and yeah go from there Boo Bear's had enough of me he's out of here what about you ladies you too Ma'am, you've got so many chew toys. Why is it? Why is it the sticks? Speaking of, yes, I'm talking to you. What's going on? It's not so hot yet. It's a good day, right? <laughs> She's like, nope. Pickles. Pickle. I'm so pretty. The grapes are doing nicely, it looks like. Kind of hiding. Like I'm in the jungle. They did trim a lot back this year because they were getting out of control, but we'll have a decent, decent amount. Again, mamas. So I think this was a pretty good week. Like I said, I had that, you know, chemical smell in here. So that might have kind of messed with the week. But these were pretty much tried and true, at least here, scents. So that shouldn't have affected too much. But um, there were a couple of things I haven't worn in quite some time. One of the days I had a headache was wearing the, on this day. And I'm like, that's impossible. It's not this. So <laughs> I knew it was. That's what tipped me off that it was the chemical smell. Um, because I'm like, that's, this is never giving me a headache and it would, it just won't. So, um, I mean, I'll try it again in the future, but I, I've just worn it before for a while. I, I've never had it happen before. So that was kind of like the go-to, um, peony and blush sweet. Love that one as well. I really enjoyed bringing out, um, Mirin Tonka, but it is a little heavy for this time of year. It just happened to be like one cool day this week that that seemed appropriate and but it was it was it's still lovely it's just heavy um more of a fall winter scent for sure or an evening scent that kind of thing but um I think it's too heavy for this time of year just my opinion um the Hermes one I really do enjoy this one if I was going to repurchase 
another one. It's probably going to be this one. So Monsieur Lee. Monsieur Lee, I guess is how you would pronounce it. Le Jardin de Monsieur Lee. Um, I, I did enjoy the, the scent for that one. And then I pulled out Miss Poppy. It's been, it's been a moment. Um, and I, I do love it. And the other thing I was thinking about while wearing that was, do y'all remember Chloe Narcisse? It's, I mean, it's been discontinued for quite some time, but, oh, I loved that fragrance so much. And I think I either got this around the time that I ran out of that one or I, I don't know why that one just popped into my head the minute I put, um, this one on. They're not that similar, but similar enough that, um, it just reminded me of it. And I know you can't get it anymore, but it was in, in the forefront of my mind. So these are going to go back, um, into their respective places. I'm going to figure out what, what this week ahead brings. We're, we're in August, full-blown August. Let's see. The girls are snoring, so I apologize. <laughs> Anywho, um, this is the tray of the week. I'm going to try out, um, well, not really try out. I'm going to bring, I've, all of these are things I love except for this high heel right here. This high heel, when I wore it, I did not like Good Girl, Good Girl by Carolina Herrera. I um, was not a fan. But I just looked at my Sephora order history, and I bought that in 2022. And I swear I've only worn it once. So I'm like, there's no way it's been sitting there since summer of 2022. So I'm a little bit crazed but anywho so I thought I'd bring it back out it's not in a spray and I don't know if I want to put it in an atomizer just to test it so we'll see how that goes I'll probably just dab it on tomorrow and, and see um we're gonna finish up the Hermes with um La Lagoon Sur La Lagoon so Un Jardin Sur La Lagoon um excited about that one. I believe I really did like that one in the, well, I'm like pointing over there. I really liked that one. Um, when I opened it up. So Milfew is one of my favorite LV fragrances. I mean, I even monogrammed the freaking bottle. Um, so really wanted to bring that out. It's raspberry leather and I forgot the other notes, but really enjoy that one. Um, Soleil Neige, I usually like to wear just the body spray. It's strong enough for me, but I also have the EDP and, um, this like traveler size, sampler size. So I thought I would grab one of those for the week. And then my last... I'm going to cry so much when this is out since they're no longer made, but, or sold, I should say, in this country. Um, one of my favorite vanillas. It's the most beautiful vanillas out there, and I just needed that this week. So this is the tray of the week. Okay, folks. So I got to tell you, I'm having a hard time getting the motivation to swap out of Ricky it um it just got nicer by the day and pillowy and squishy and soft and, 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 and all the things um i just really enjoyed using her this week so um i'm really excited that i have it and there's more on my wish list at the real world there's one that's like black with white sides which is really tempting um there's a purple one which is <laughs> and a couple other colors so um I don't know I may I may just need to pick up another one because I I gotta tell you they I can see why there's a craze about them at least this particular leather seems really really nice so I mean I'm gonna swap out I'm gonna put it away I'm gonna carry it in Chicago and um yeah. Oh, before I forget, I went and returned my um, sticky purse at Nordstrom Rack and the gal's like, is there anything wrong with it? I'm like, yeah, it smells and it's sticky. And she goes to grab it. And she goes, oh God, we're going to damage this out. <laughs> I'm like, thank you. Nobody deserves to have this crap in their life. So um, there's at least that. We'll see. I, I have a feeling I'll go back in like a week and I'll see it on the shelf just sitting there. But 
we'll see. We'll see if they make good on that. But I'm going to get everything out of Ricky and put her away. And I'm going to figure out what what's going to take it the place and be up to this standard for next week. Okay, we're going to go with the substantial, the plentiful, the abundant transatlantic that I just acquired. Um, just because the color of it lends itself to this time of year. I don't foresee me being able to use it past May, October, even that's pushing it. Probably just literally this month and next month. And after that, it's, it's probably sayonara because it's such a light color. It'll get dirty really easily. Um, I mean, it's already kind of dirty. It's an old bag, but, um, I think it will work. And if I had to pop it into the office, which I believe I do this week, I'm trying to remember, I think I have one meeting in the office, so I can throw my computer in relatively easily, real quickly. Um, there's side pockets here, so, and then this pocket here, I think this will, this, this will work. So I'm not going to bother with an organizer, I'm just going to throw everything in there. I was having the heck of a time in the Ricky because it's black on the inside. And even though I put that light colored organizer in there, these suckers kind of went off to the side and got lost. So since this has an abundance of room, I'm going to take both pairs of glasses, light pair and the dark pair. That way I will not be without or fumbling for the, uh, the amount. The question is though, do I need a another type of catch-all in case I need to run around so I could swap out the Louis Vuitton for this one maybe no just gonna throw everything in just gonna throw everything in and then if I go shopping anywhere this can this will have enough room to hold everything so let's just do that let's just throw everything in there is a nice pocket right here i'm gonna throw my card holder and cash right through there there is so much room so much room oh my god it's just like what can't i put in this bag so i'll, I'll make more sense of it phone can go right here it's beautiful. I'll make more sense of it later, but if I do need to use it as a work tote, there is room and I can just throw as much crap in there as I need. I mean, all it needs is like a crossbody strap and I would be like never leaving this kind of bag. So real cute. These side pockets, water bottle, pretty awesome. One on each side. I mean, this is like the perfect bag. He just designed something. If it wasn't patent, I, I said I have to get one of these in black or something. It's it's just a beautiful size. So big bags unite. <laughs> this is the bag of the week. The Reed Crake Off Transatlantic. Thank you, Craig. <laughs> See you later. Okay, so we're closing out our day. I'm looking braggart <laughs> braggart <laughs> haggard so i am wrapping it up we've got the new manicure on and you can barely tell that it started out like this and it's ending up like that you can see the just the tips of it right there still it's hot <laughs> it's hot outside but it was really funny as it when you're painting it on it starts out like this and like immediately because it's so hot it went to this mango color um so i just had to laugh about that but as it cools down it turns the the pinky tone very cute though so my inner 12 year old is totally excited i hope you had a great week i hope your next week is wonderful as well um yeah, I just hope that you enjoy your time. I want it to change back to pink. Come on. <laughs> the very, the very lightest bit there. Uh, yeah, so girls are going to hang out in the AC. I'm going to try to make myself look less 
uh, rest, chill out, literally. And we'll see you next time. I have no idea what my video on uh, Wednesday-ish will be. Not a whole lot. Maybe I'll make some commentary. Who knows? Who knows? We'll see. Maybe I'll go shopping tomorrow. I don't know. I don't know. Or maybe I'll take the week off. Oh, I've got some online purchases. You never know. I fly by the seat of my pants here. <laughs> See you later. Have a good week. Talk to you soon. Take care. Bye.